Welcome to the beautiful Ice Fields Parkway, Canada. We are here today amidst the incredible Rocky Mountain glaciers with a cardio yoga workout practice. This quick and effective class will be focused on fusing toning and metabolism boosting exercises with the fluid movement of sun salutations to give you the perfect balance of power, agility, strength, and grace. So if you're ready to breathe, move, and sweat, grab your mat and let's begin. All right, friends, let's begin today seated at the back of your mat. We're just gonna start with a quick warm up, reaching both arms up to the sky, and then exhale, bring your hands to heart. Just begin to deepen that inhalation, and exhale down to your heart. And one more time, inhale, big reach up. Exhale, slowly bring yourself over to your hands and knees. Tuck your toes underneath and press yourself up into downward facing dog. Awesome. Taking this opportunity right now to just stretch it out, stretch out your feet, your ankles, the backs of your legs, your shoulders. Breathing in deeply. Exhale, let it go. Awesome, first exercise here. Lift the heels, bend your knees. You're gonna shoot forward into high plank. From here, open to side plank one. Back to center, side plank to the other side. Back to center, bend your knees, hips to the heels. And again, high plank, side plank, center, other side. Back to plank and then the hips back to the heels. Again, shoot out to your plank. Open to the side. Center, make sure you're breathing. Side, center, and then bend your knees, hips back. Back out to plank, just keep it going. Pull the navel into the spine, engage your core. Back to your high plank, bend your knees, and now from here, shoot out into plank and then take your chaturanga. Release the back toes, opening into upward facing dog. And exhale, push back, release into your downward facing dog. Beautiful work. Taking a deep breath in, lift the heels, bend your knees. Exhale, hop towards the front of your mat. Inhale, come on up halfway, so lengthening through the spine. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, slowly standing up tall, reaching both arms up to the sky. Exhale, hands to heart. Inhale from here, let's reach up, coming into your Utkatasana chair. Release, you're gonna hop back into plank. Add a push up, back up, hop to the front of your mat, back to your chair. Keep it going. If you wanna modify, just come into plank without the push up. Hop forward, chair position. Keep it going. Hop back, push up or hold your plank. Hop forward, keep it low with your hips. And again, hop back. You can keep your feet apart if that feels easier, more stable for you, so your chair will be slightly open, or you can keep your feet and legs together. Just see how this feels on your body, just keep it going. Again, work your way up, so maybe just hop into plank first, don't do the push-up yet. Really focus on engaging your core, engaging your lower body. Stay with your breath, bring it down, bring it up, hop forward, arms up, chair posture, Release, hop back into plank. This time, take your chaturanga. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Good job, just take a breath. Take a moment, and then we're gonna keep it going. Bend your knees, hop towards the front of your mat. Inhale, arms reaching up as your hips get low. Let's come into our Utkatasana again, chair. Good, feet together or slightly apart. Come down lower and extend, reach up. So we're doing our chair squats. Low and extend fully. Low and reach. Good, keep it going. So when you come down low, bring your hands over towards your heart and then you reach up tall. Bring it down, breathe with it and reach. Down and reach. Really feeling this engagement through your quadriceps. Keep your core strong and engaged. Reach it up and lower. Reach it up and lower, hold it here. Beautiful, stay low with that chair position. 
And then from here, we're gonna shift our weight over to the left side, arms down, right knee up, pull the navel into the spine, step your right foot back into your high lunge, bring that right knee back up to your middle. Lunge, shift your weight forward, and bring the knee up. Lunge, knee up. So a lot of strength here is happening through that front left foot. Good, really find that center. Use the strength of your arms as well as your body comes up, right knee comes up to your chest, your arms come down. Reach and up. Reach and up. Reach, get nice and low into that crescent lunge. Reach and up. Reach, hold it here, high lunge. Take that breath, breathe in deeply. Reach both arms up to the sky. Feel that beautiful stretch through your legs, through your psoas. Extend the front knee. Exhale, bend both knees and let's just pump it. Bend those elbows into cactus. Four, five, six, good, seven, stay strong. Eight, nine, ten. Beautiful, extend the back knee, arms reach up. As you exhale, now you're gonna dive your arms down, step back into plank, or you can keep that front leg extended out. And then take your chaturanga. Inhale, upward facing dog. And exhale, push back, release into your downward facing dog. Beautiful work. All right, we're gonna take it to the other side now. Take a deep breath in, find your center. Lift the heels, bend your knees, hop to the front of your mat. Inhale, halfway lengthen. Exhale, let's fold it forward. Feel that stretch in your hamstrings. Inhale, standing up nice and tall like the mountain. Exhale, hands together over to your heart. Let's go ahead and come to that chair position again. Reach both arms up. Exhale, chair squat for two. Reach and three. Get nice and low with your hips. And four. Reach and five. Breathe with me. Reach and six, reach, exhale, seven, bring those hands to your heart as you get low, eight, and nine, you got it, and ten, awesome, stay low, and then from here, come on up, nice and tall, shift your weight over to your right side, left knee towards your belly button, and then from this position, arms down, step back with your left foot, arms up, Bring the left knee to the chest for one. Reach it up and two. Step back, arms open, arms down, knee up for three. Reach and four. So now most of our weight is in that front foot and we're really engaging not just the lower body but also the strength of your core. Good, keeping you balanced and strong. Don't rush it. If you need to slow down the tempo, that's totally fine. Just focus on your form, focus on your breath. Good, and open, knee up. Stand back, open into that high lunge, hold it here, open up that heart, that center. Reach both arms up to the sky. Cactus arms, now bend your elbows, extend that front knee. Exhale, bend both knees and we pump. Two, just a little pulse. Three, keep that knee above the floor. Good, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Extend the back knee, arms reach up to the sky. Exhale, from here you're gonna dive both arms down towards the mat. Right foot steps back into plank or you can extend it above the floor, chaturanga. Inhale, upward facing dog, open up and stretch. Exhale, push back, release into that downward Facing dog, good. This is your moment to catch your breath. Find your center, your presence within. All right, one more exercise. We're gonna come forward into that high plank position. Pull the navel into the spine. Variation one, toe tap to the side, other foot, and center. Variation two, right knee to elbow, and then left knee to left elbow. All right, take whatever variation and let's begin. One, and two, keep going. Three, four, now remember, just keep that tempo. You don't need to rush. If you need to slow it down, that's totally fine. Focus on your form, so make sure your shoulders are above your wrists. 
Your belly button is pulled in towards the spine so your core is engaged. Keep it going. Tuck it in and out. Tuck it in and out or just step out to the side. Working and engaging the obliques as well as your entire core, your shoulders. Last one. Awesome. Take that Chaturanga Dandasana. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, lift the hips and release it back into that downward facing dog. Beautiful work. Breathe it in. Exhale out. Good. Just take a second. Find your breath. Find your center. Take a deep breath in. And then when you're ready, exhale, drop down to your knees and sit back over to your heels into your child's pose. Just give your upper body a quick little stretch. Fingers reaching towards the front of your mat. Take a deep breath in. Exhale, let it go. Slowly rolling yourself up to seated. And taking one big breath in, arms reach up to the sky. And then hands come down to your heart. Thank you so much for joining me today amidst the Rocky Mountains. I send you all my love and all my light. Namaste. Thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed this class, it would mean the world to us if you click that subscribe button to help our content rise to the top. Thanks again, and we'll see you soon.